Hey guys, what's up? It's Ambush here with another Apex Legends video and today I'll be showing you my complete caustic guide. Now this guide will consist of tips and tricks for his ultimate and tactical as well as what legends he pairs well with and just in general tips on how to improve your caustic gameplay. So I really hope you enjoyed the video and let's get right into it. Now let's start by talking about Caustic's passive. His passive is pretty simple, it's called Nox Vision, where you gain threat vision on enemies moving through your gas. Now this is a very simple passive, but also extremely useful because you can directly pinpoint where the enemies are, and you can tell how far they're getting through your gas. If they're going to push you through the gas, you'll be able to tell instantly, and you can turn around and beam them. Now Caustic also has the Fortified perk where he can basically take 15% less damage. But don't get too overconfident with this perk because it really evens out to just about one extra bullet. So you'll only be taking one extra bullet compared to someone like Bangalore or Horizon or any of the legends. So don't get too cocky and just spring into the open spaces. Now let's get into the tips and tricks of Caustic's tactical. Tip number one is that you can only have six canisters down at one time. If you place down a seventh, the first one you placed will disappear. And you just really don't want to do that because it could mess up your whole setup and cause you to die. So just try and keep track of how many you have down at one time. Caustic tip number two is that when your gas traps are deploying, they can be shot out instantly. If the enemies just shoot it once when it's not fully deployed, it will just instantly get destroyed. You don't even have to shoot it out at the bottom like normal. You can just shoot it anywhere and it'll disappear. So just try and be careful when you're throwing it into open spaces. Caustic tip number three is that his gas traps have a 25 second cooldown, but you can stack three of them and they do five damage per second. Now this isn't a whole lot of damage, but if the enemies get stuck in it, it can really stack up to be a lot of damage and could really sway the firefight in your favor. Caustic tip number four is that your gas slows enemies. This is a really basic tip, but I think it's one that you need to know because if enemies get stuck in your gas, it's really hard for them to get out, like this off team right here. And then you can chase them down and you can just totally laser them. Caustic tip number five is a pretty big tip, and that is that you can block doors with traps, which can be used aggressively, defensively, or as a zoning technique. There's a lot of different ways you can abuse this ability and you just gotta know how to use it. So if you're in a tough situation, you can throw down your traps on the doors and your enemies can't push you from behind and then you can just focus on what is in front or you can block enemies in with your traps and then go around to another entrance and attack them from the other side. There's a lot of different ways you can do this and it's extremely useful in almost all of them. Tip number six is that Caustic's gas can break other legend abilities such as Watson's fences, the amped part of Rampart's shields, Crypto's drone, and it can even stop Lifeline's health drone from healing the enemies. Tip number seven is that you can use your gas as visual cover. It's very useful if you just have to throw down your ultimate just to keep yourself safe or even throw a tactical down just to hide in a corner behind it. It's extremely useful when you're low on HP and try and heal like I am in this clip. Tip number eight is that you can use your gas to watch for third parties. If you just place down a couple traps at a choke point, it'll let you know if enemies are coming through because they'll either get hit by it or destroy the traps. Now, if you get caught up in the fight, sometimes you do not notice this, but you just need to try and take time to look back at your traps and see if they're still up because it is extremely useful to tell if you're getting third partied and need to get out of that situation. Tip number 9 is that your tactical and ultimate will get destroyed by a Watson ult. So just be careful when you're pushing a Watson that's camped in a building because if the interception pylon is up, all of your abilities will get destroyed by it. So try and take that out before you put down your gas. Tip number 10 is that you should always try and revive your teammates in gas. It will give you visual cover and it will prevent enemies from pushing in on you without taking a ton of damage. It's a really good strategy because then you and your teammate will be safe for a little bit longer when you get up than normal and you can try and pop a few heals before you go back into the fight. Now let's get into some tips and tricks for Caustic's ultimate. Ultimate tip number one is that Caustic's ult explodes almost instantly and it covers a lot more ground. So this is really useful if there are enemies on you and you just have to throw it down to protect yourself because it will instantly detonate and they will get a ton of damage taken from the gas. 
Tip number two is that you can use your ultimate as sort of a zoning tool to like block enemies when you're trying to hold them in the ring or just stop them from pushing on you and your team. You can also use it as a defensive mechanism. If there's enemies pushing in on you and you're low on HP and they're right on top of you, just throw down your alt, it'll protect yourself, they won't be able to push you, and you'll just kind of have a safe space to just take a breath and heal up. Tip number three is that your ultimate, just like your tactical, does get destroyed by Watson's ultimate. So if you see an interception pylon down, try and destroy it before you throw your ultimate. Otherwise, it'll your ultimate will get destroyed by the pylon and you won't get it back. It'll go right back to 0% and you'll have to wait for it to charge up again. Tip number four is that you can use your ultimate to try and flush enemies out of a building if they're camping. So as you can see, there's an enemy inside this building, and I know I've used this clip quite a few times, but it's just a great example. If you throw your ultimate in, like if there's a crack in one of the buildings, like the buildings in King's Canyon, you can throw it in on them, and then they'll get stuck in it, take a ton of damage, and you can just beam them and kill them instantly, like I did in this situation. Tip number five is that you can use your ultimate in the final ring so that the enemies take way more damage than you guys and die before you guys add to the storm. Now I'm sorry I don't have any footage of this because none of my games made it to the final ring, but it is a really useful strategy if you're playing ranked or something and it's just a massive scrim at the end. Now I'll talk about some potential legend combos with Caustic, like what legends pair well with him and what you can do to make their abilities more effective. In this clip, I'm showing you right here on screen me in this Octane trade. <laughs> now, I'm really sorry I didn't get any footage of these legend combos, but I explain it pretty well, and you guys can just hop the game and try it out yourself. Combo number one is Watson and Caustic. I used to do this combo all the time, and me and my friends would go camp bunker, but that was a really long time ago, back when we weren't as good at the game. So, that is a way that you can really secure yourself some placement. And, you know, it's just fun to take some bunker fights because one team gets the top, one team gets the bottom, and it just kind of turns into your own little 3v3. This combo is also really strong because you can use the double trapping technique, so the enemies just can't push you at all. If they can't get through the Watson fences, they also can't go through the caustic gas, they'll take a ton of damage if they do try to push you. So it's just a really strong combo because you can really just keep all enemies out of your space. Also, the Watson ulti will prevent grenades from flushing you guys out of your building. Combo number two is Caustic and Rampart. Now, this combo is really strong because when you're Rampart and you have your amped walls up, enemies can just jump behind them if they're pushing you and you're low on HP. But with the Caustic gas, if they jump behind the barriers, they're going to get take a ton of damage to the gas and they'll be slowed and you'll be able to kill them really easily so it'll just create your own sort of safe little space and you can just take a breath if there's enemies just pushing it all around you. Our third and final legend combo is Caustic and Horizon. How this one works is basically Horizon will throw down Newt, the black hole, on your enemies and then Caustic will throw in his ultimate ability and the enemies will get trapped in the black hole and slowed by the Caustic's gas which basically makes it inescapable, unless they use their abilities, of course. But this combo is just really deadly because you can really trap the enemies and it's super easy to get the knocks they get stuck in the gas and the black hole. Alright guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please like and subscribe, it really helps me out. And comment down below what guide you'd like to see next. Now, I'll catch you in the new season. See you later!